Hull is a 19th century village on the western edge of the Blue Mountains in a small tributary valley of the River Let. It consists of 17 buildings of historic significance dating from the 1837 Greek Revival Courthouse to the Timber and Iron Corny's Garage, built in 1945. Hartley is now owned and protected by the Office of Environment and Heritage and looked after by the National Parks and Wildlife Service of New South Wales. Hartley Courthouse was designed by colonial architect Mortimer Lewis in the Grecian Revival style and completed in 1837 for £1,476. It contains a well-preserved courthouse and a fascinating lockup where early convicts, bushrangers and cattle thieves scratch their names, their crimes and sentences into the timberline walls. St. Bernard's Presbytery was built in the late 1850s and was once a home for the priests who held Mass at St. Bernard's Church. St. Bernard's Church was built from pale sandstone which was quarried at South Bowen Fells and hand sawn local timber. The church, with a strong Gothic style, is characterised by its distinctive French influence.
Cornies and Sons service station was built around 1945 with modern asbestos cement and galvanised iron. The Shamrock Inn was built in the mid-1840s and occupied as a residence by the Phillips family for a lengthy period. It catered for the needs of the men and women en route to and from the goldfields of Hill End, Safala and the Turon workings. Ivy Cottage was built in the 1850s by John Finn and became the police magistrate's house. From here, please enjoy the rest of the tour around historic Hartley Village. <laughs>